So Cody Sanchez will probably call you dumb as hell if you bought a business using money after hearing what we're going to show you today. Roland Frazier will probably fly out personally and slap you on the face if you still try to buy money after this. And then Rockefeller himself will roll over in his grave after. Never mind. I'm just kidding. How can we guarantee that after you agency owners apply what we show you in the agency to partner program you can make up to 200k per month this is a guarantee curtis go ahead and go over step one so the first step is we talk about the 10 monetization methodologies plus a couple of the bonus methodologies in terms of adding armies in whether that's a, a militia army an affiliate army uh or a affiliate nation with the partnerships. We talk about all of those things. So just plugging those in will give you a, a measure, a tremendous measure of towards that $200,000. But there's a there's an even, um, there's a turbocharged way of doing that. And why don't you talk about that, Dave? Yes, Lord. Okay, so we are gonna be adding different monetization streams other than what they already have in their current business. So if a business is trying to sell their current business, we'll be able to increase their valuation. And what we're going to be doing is creating a digital twin coined by the brother, which is a buyer and a seller of businesses himself, Mr. Curtis Witt right there across from me online. All right. So we're going to increase the valuation of the company. They'll be able to have a, a larger exit. So not only will you, the agency owner that converts them to partners, be able to make exponentially more than you would if you were to just get some client retainer at, at a regular agency model. Um, <laughs> but the business owner is going to benefit greatly as well. So the second reason we can guarantee that you'll be able to get to 200K or more per month is because <clears throat> one of the most difficult things that you do as an agency owner is prospecting. A lot of you guys are uh, using instantly.ai. Even I in the past have promoted to you guys all of these scrapers and 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 uh, text blast softwares and 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 voice calling softwares to prospect and DMing scripts and all of that stuff, that can be a thing of the past. So just this partnership that me and Curtis is creating right now is worth the uh, the 5K to get into this program to be, able to, <clears throat> to be able to buy businesses. You can buy into businesses without using your own cash, without using cash, period. But you still mm -hmm. get the equity benefits of the business owner and you never put any money into it. You have no responsibilities, no liabilities or none of that using what we teach. So how are we going to do this? You're going to have unlimited business owners to partner with. The business owners are literally going to be fed to you through the partnerships that we're about to talk to you about. We're about to talk yeah. to you about the partnerships that we're creating. So now. Like I said, one of the hardest things to do is not the marketing and the fulfillment. A lot of you guys are good at running ads and doing SEO. <clears throat> but the hardest part is getting past the gatekeeper. And then when you get past the gatekeeper, um, the next hardest part, <clears throat> excuse me, the next hardest part is getting them to agree to even pay you or allow you to. Some of you guys can't even get people on free trials. Right. So the fact that me and Curtis came with the genius idea of partnering with business brokers. No one else is doing that in the agency uh, uh, model industry. Nobody right. is teaching you guys to partner with business brokers. You go straight to where the hot fish are. You're a bear and you're fishing upstream where the fish are just hopping out the water and jumping straight into your mouth, Pause. This it's not is even a stream. Exactly. It, it's not even a stream. You're a bear just, just putting your paw in a barrel of fish. It's yeah. not even a stream. It, it, yeah. it's, you just put your paw right down there and... Putting it in there. Yeah, Good. yeah, exactly. Oh, so, so we control the supply and the demand now. That's why it's never been anything like this before because 
at will, you can you can have direct contact and communication with with the business owners that you never had before because the broker is literally going to broker the freaking uh conversations they're going to broker the communications we don't have to worry about any of that they have business owners that have listings uh or businesses for sale that's been sitting there for months and some of them even years that when we approach them letting them know that yo you can exit not only are you not getting bites but you're going to start getting bites like buyers are going to want to buy your business. We're going to make it way more attractive when you when you're trying to sell it. But now you're going to be able to exit at a higher close. Go ahead and tell them a little bit more about that, Curtis. So so when you think about it, when, when I was buying businesses, um, one of the things that I would do is go to the business broker and they would broker the deal. They would look at businesses that were. Um, that were on the market that I would either be on the buying side and I'd have someone representing me or I'd call the broker that's on the selling side and he would be represent he or she would be representing the buyer, etc. We're going the complete opposite way such that it's so attractive to a business broker, I, in fact, I talked to one of them uh, yesterday and he was like, this is the greatest thing because now I can take this list of people. First, I can take all my backlog and I can go back years to people who, you know, I couldn't sell their business or for one way or the other, one reason or the other, it didn't work out, you know, and now I can go back to them with the proposition of how we can literally sell their business. It takes anywhere from six to nine months to a year to sell a business. We can reduce that time frame by half at a minimum, right? So that's the first benefit Love for, for, for um, exactly for, for them. But the other thing is from a, from a broker perspective, it now that differentiates them from everybody else. They mm. have a superpower as it relates to the digital twin that nobody else has. So they you have, you're strengthening the pitch of the bit. You you're you're strengthening the pitch of the business broker. So now they'll be able to get the listings uh, before any other business broker in their market. When they approach a business and the business is thinking, why should I sell, you know, use you to list my business? The same as if a realtor is trying to list someone's house to sell, like all these other people, why would I why would use you, right? So right. now the pitch of the broker will be, not only am I going to help you sell it, I'm going to help you sell it faster and it's going to be worth more. It's going to be worth more than what you're trying to sell it for right now through the absolutely. digital screen. Go ahead. That's absolutely right. So, so, you, so they have that as their advantage. They also get an opportunity to have, you know, you get their, their regular commission. They could get a digital twin commission for selling it. They could get a portion of the equity in the digital twin. They could be able to keep it, keep it for passive income for themselves in terms of their portion of it. There, there are um, quite a few opportunities these for the business broker themselves. So why would they not? I mean, you 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 look at it from their past, their past um, listings, their current listings, and their future listings. And oh. so it is a genius idea to partner with the business brokers because that's where the fish are. It's that's sort of like. That's where the fish are. You go to the stream, and in our case, the barrel, not even the stream. The barrel, right? You go to the barrel where all the little goldfish are, and all you have to do is stick your spear in. Boom. Yes, Lord. Boom. Yes, Lord. I don't think y'all understanding, even though we're recording this and it's past when we're recording this and you're watching this in the future, I still can see that y'all haven't that. put no hashtag yes, Lords in the comment. If, I don't think y'all understand the gravity of this. We literally just solved multiple industry problems with this one partnership, this single move right here. We have made it to where business brokers will stand out and get 
way more listings without friction. And then we made it to where all of you, uh, oh, I wake up in the morning and I scrape my email and my SMS list and I get my DM pitch and, and my closing script prepared and all of that for outreach and stuff. We just solved the yeah. outreach problem through partnerships, through leverage. You never have to prospect again. You don't have to prospect again because through partnerships of these business brokers, they have businesses that they're already close with. They're working with them. They can just call them on the phone right now. No gatekeeper. No, uh, uh, oh, wait till they get back. No, oh, what if this goes in the spam folder or the promotions tab? None of that. This, <laughs> they, they got them right on tap and then they can just say, yo, business owner. Next Friday, I'm putting you on a call with Curtis and David. Curtis and David is going to explain the digital twin of how that's going to increase your valuation so that you'll be able to exit uh, for a larger exit when you're ready to sell faster than you would have sold without these guys. What time can you talk to Curtis and David? We don't even have to set that up. We don't prospect. We don't have to have a booking calendar like you guys, right? If you're an agency owner right now, you can literally do away with all of that. You can do away with all of that just by creating partnerships with brokers. So we're doing that right now in mass so that when you guys get into the agency, the partner program, as soon as you get in, you'll be able to go through a con our little black book of brokers, message or call a broker that we partner with and be like, yo, what do you got for me? Who you, who you got for me? And they'll say, okay, let me make some calls. And they'll say- right. In return, you know, they'll reply back to you, okay, I got this nail shop, or okay, I got this chiropractic clinic, okay, I got this mas uh, massage therapist place, or I got this uh, cool sculpting technician person guy, or whatever, right? They'll reply back with that, and then you say, okay, well, set it up. And then now you start figuring out, okay, what's the first steps to plugging in the 10 monetization methods when I get on a call with this business owner? And there, the broker is going to do the negotiations for you. The broker is going to show the business owner your terms and conditions that you will agree to. So they're, you're not even going to get on the call unless they already see that you want to plug in as many of those 10 monetization steps as possible. Woo! All right, so, man. This is just this is crazy, yeah, Curtis, man. Crazy. So, so, we, so so you 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 solve our problem as it relates to all the booking calendars and having to go after businesses, we got fish in a barrel. You saw the broker's right. problem it relates to being able to sell their, their past fail leads, their current leads, and giving them an, a super advantage in terms of their future listings. And you solve the business owner's problems in terms of <laughs> the valuation of their company yeah, and how fast they can exit. And so you solved that problem. And oh, by the way, you didn't, you didn't, the fourth problem you solved is a problem that is overlooked. And you know what that is, David? That what is, is things are tight out here. And one of the avenues that the digital twin promotes is affiliates. And the mm -hmm. customers of that business can be an affiliate of that business, which means that customer can bring in and have an extra stream of income. Boom. Pow! Boom. Yeah, so it's actually five people that benefit. So we, we, we got to get to that a little bit later. So let me put that on the on the dang on list. Let me add affiliates. Hey, y'all, y'all going to want to stay to the end for this. I know I know how it is. A lot of people have short attention spans, but I don't believe that bull crap for real. I believe if you know that something is good for you and you can make money from it and you, it can change your life, you should be able to sit through it without transitions and B-roll on the screen and all of that distracting bull crap. Grow up. We're grown ups. Pay attention to this because this can change your life. If you're struggling, if you have some type of issue where it's difficult for you to make money or you can't go back to work or you don't want to go back to work or you're trying to buy a business, but you don't 
have 50, 80, $100,000 or any of that stuff, or you don't want to come up with the money, or you don't want to use your credit or anyone else's credit, and you're trying to think of creative ways of investing, this is where it is. And if you're in the agency model and you're tired of having a million clients just to make $10,000, now you, you got a million people paying you $500 for a short form content just so you can make it to ten to $20,000. This is where you can pull that type of money out of one partner, right? So this right here has solved two industries, two, two, two little dudes right here on here. We've, you know, through the graces of the most high God have figured out how to solve the agency model and how to solve the business buying model. Okay. Uh, let's go to the next one, man. All right. So for the first time in history, for the first time in history, we disrupted two industries, the agency model. You can talk about that one. And I can talk about the business buying model. Why don't you take okay. the agency model? Yes, sir. Okay. So for as long as I can remember, um, you know, after my little stint trying to do real estate wholesaling in 2015, 16, when I realized that uh, business owners would pay me for leads and pay me for marketing, one of the most tedious and exhausting um, <laughs> tasks that you have to do, like it's like muscle memory now, is prospecting. Um, and every business, now that I think about it, majority of the businesses that work off leads have prospecting to do. But we've solved that through joint ventures and partnerships. Mm -hmm. You do not have to prospect anymore if you're an agency owner. You do not have to have a lot of clients in order to make a lot of money. See, I see a lot of you guys starting to wake up. I feel like we're coming out of one of the matrixes. There's a lot of matrixes. feel like we're coming out of one of them. How do I know? Because there's this trend of growth partners coming around. You're finally starting to realize your worth. Hold on. I'm the one with the marketing skills. Why am I only getting $1,500 a month when I took them from their $100,000 uh, per month to $500,000 and I'm still at $1,500. So now you guys are starting to add on a commission clause and all of that stuff, right? A percentage and all of that stuff. That's cool. That's cool. But what we're doing for agency owners now, you're being able to collaborate with business owners and become partial business owners if you want to. You don't even have to have your name on the their documents or any of that type of stuff. But you, right. through your own agreement forms, can participate in the exits themselves. You'll be able to make money if they ever were to decide to close uh, uh, out that business or sell it off to somebody or even send it to their son or whatever they want to do. You, if they create new locations or whatever, your revenue, your income goes up with that, literally. Right. Not just on some commission. Oh, I get paid, uh, you know, the retainer and I get paid a commission. No, 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 no. Whenever they increase whatever they're doing, you increase. You're going to have the freedom to be able to create uh, new revenue streams for them, new products and suggest new services, all of that, because you're going to be an actual partner. So it's like you're a business owner with them, but you don't have the responsibilities and the liabilities, right? Okay, so that's how we're disrupting the agency model. We're showing you your true worth, not just that you deserve some type of cut from the sale, who, whatever, you want a cut from the business. You want a cut from the legacy. You want control right. power. You understand? And that's what agency, the partner uh, membership helps you guys gain. You don't have to have a lot of clients anymore. You can go fire all of them and just convert three to five of them into partners, plug in a 10 monetization methods, make them agree to your terms, and then you're pretty much good for the rest of your life. As long as they're in business, I'll say that for the lifetime of their businesses, you won't even have to prospect anymore. Think about that. Because a lot of us are on churn. Like, okay, we get we do good this month. We get we get to one hundred and fifty thousand dollars a month. Like I see all the freaking videos. And then the next month, what you don't upload is that you didn't after a lot of people left you down to about fifty thousand dollars a month now. 
Now you got to hit up your email softwares and all of that stuff and set up the sequences again to try to get you some more clients. Aren't you tired of getting clients? Aren't you tired of uh, consultation and strategy calls and all of that bull crap repeating the same thing over and over? Like, like let's get lifetime partners. You hear me? But anyway, go ahead with the business model. Tell them how we're uh, disrupting the business buying model, Curtis. Before I tell them that, let me just say that let's just be really clear about the agency model and the, the marketing model. And, and it really is you're, you're disrupting it from going from a service provider to a partner. And in that partnership, that is completely different from the from a normal partner who would have the responsibility, accountability, and actually not all the authority, quite honestly, to to do something in the business. And so you're literally having a hybrid model without any of that, without any of that liability. And so that's a disruption as it relates to being a service provider to a partner. All right. So when I was buying businesses, I brought my partner with the broker to find the business. And then I put up the money or I find the capital or I put up the credit and you know the, the whole process. And that's what people teach it, teach today. There's all variations of it and there's nothing wrong with that if that's what you want to do. So there, there is because we're 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 not saying we're what we are saying is that we're different. We're not saying it's better, yeah. worse, or the same. It's different, right? And so what everybody on the market is basically doing is a hybrid or some form of buying the business, but you control that business. And at the end of the day, whether you bought it for no money down, whether you use your nephew's credit to buy it, whether you <laughs> use the investor's money to buy it, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, you actually own that business, which means you had a responsibility for everything in that business. And when it closes, you had a responsibility for everything in that business. Now, let's look at our model and how we disrupt that. Everything to nothing. Because you are and all the equity in one particular group uh, or one particular entity to having a portion of the equity or all of it, it depends on your negotiation with the digital yeah. twin plus the negotiation of a portion of the equity in the physical side. But here's the difference. Your net worth has increased dramatically with no responsibility, accountability, or liability. That's the disruption huge disruption because now we aren't we aren't it's definitely no money down but it's no liability mm -hmm. down it's no, hey. it's, it's no responsibility <laughs> down it's no legality down you know uh -huh. it's none of those down no money down no liability down no legality down no responsibility down and all you're doing is running up on the side of them and bolting on the most value added piece that they could have in their business. And mm -hmm. you can change the valuation of the business as well. Because as we talk about, Amazon is a digital company with physical fulfillment. Walmart yeah. is a physical company with sometimes digital fulfillment in terms of their e-commerce. And so it's a, and you get different valuations based on where you are. And so yeah. if you can turn that company into a digital company, the valuation eat soars even more. And so and that's we what the disruption. Yeah. And we know this works because about two years ago, I remember seeing some ads uh, from Ty Lopez. This is when he came out of wherever he was disappeared from. Uh, and then he disappeared again, but he's just coming back again. But he started buying up old e-commerce brands like Dressborn, a lot of these offline, um, um, you know, retail companies and stuff. And then he'll build pretty much what we're trying to teach you guys to do. He, but he was using money to buy them. That's the difference. 
So he was like actually buying them with money uh, or partnering with billionaires and then they'll buy them. But what he'll do is he'll increase the valuation of them like super fast and like the revenue and all of that. He'll build them sites. Some of them didn't have sites and stuff. He'll like drive crazy traffic and then he'll sell them like what Curtis is talking about with the multiples and everything. Um, right. Um, so what what I wanted to land back on what Curtis was saying when he said no money down, no liability or legalities down. Pay attention to this, guys. I know I always tell you guys, if you ain't got no cash yet, it's because you don't own no assets. Well, I want to kind of modify that. A wise man said, control everything, but own nothing, right? Why? Because when you do have assets, they can be seized. <laughs> All right. So that it's cool. You can have some assets tucked off. Right. But a lot of things that you control, you don't want in your name. So a lot of you guys that are coming on here and thinking about buying business, you're like, Man, I want to buy the business. I want it to be in my name. That's pride. And the Bible says pride comes before the fall. What you want to do is you want to control. You want to be your own bootleg version of the Illuminati. All right. <laughs> you want to control a conglomerate of businesses and profit from a uh, uh, from a, a high number of businesses. You want to control the education, the policy, the services, whatever comes out of that business, the face, the imagery of the business without showing your face, without showing your imagery and everything like that, right? So like I sold limo service champs and the dude never even seen me before, right? Like you want you want to be like that because then it, it I don't want to say it puts you above governments, but it, it helps with that. Um, but But my point is, the whole point, guys, is that you want to make a lot of money. You want to make it fast. You want to make it safe so that you can keep it. And okay. this model that we're showing you guys is allowing us and you guys to do that when you take action. Quick little plug real quick, just in case somebody has the goal. As you go into the, the, uh, the pinned comment or the description of this video, you'll see the first link is for a two hour coaching session with me and Curtis, both coaches for two hours, no rush or anything. That's for you guys that can't afford uh, the 5K to get in. We'll just go over everything, show you exactly how to get started, pretty much give you the entire like training and steps and implementation on that two hour call, uh, you know, just mm -hmm. in case you can't afford the 5K. For those of you who can afford the membership, that is 5K, but it has a, a, a down payment, right, Curtis? It has That's a down payment. Time. So you can either yeah. pay the 5K, that way you don't have no, you know, like, you know, monthlies or nothing, or you can put a 1K uh down and you can see the site or whatever in the in the first pin comment or whatever but i just want you guys to know hesitation and procrastination are both the fathers of failure yes i know i got two daddies that's perfect for 2023 with all the bull crap going on right <laughs> and and or, or another thing i wanted to say and i just proved this to my wife because she's getting out there um, with her business and everything being more visible on the other side of fear is usually success. So a lot right. of you guys are skeptical. A lot of you guys are fearful. A lot of you, oh, uh, five thousand dollars. Let's check this out. How much you spend on your car without a second thought, right? But we ain't even finna go down that road. Like how much money you made back from your car, unless you put it on tour road. Why did you spend five k on the car? Down or all together. Why did you spend that? See? And you were excited to do that, weren't you? Exactly. So, no, this right here can allow you to own mm, at, at rapid paces, like multiple partnerships where you'll have business owners, equity benefits, and everything like that. You don't do that with the regular business buying That's model. Very important you, you, you can't buy businesses that fast with the regular business buying model. Even if you're leveraging somebody else's credit or somebody else's money, they're they're not going to keep allowing you to borrow or leverage them until they see wins and stuff like that. But with us, we have multiple brokers that we're partnering with, and they're going to have multiple business owners coming in, and we can deal with however many we want to plug into. 
or how little you want to plug into it, right? But let's go ahead and move on, Curtis. All right. So let's talk about the, the last portion of it is who benefits and, uh, and how will they benefit? Who will who all benefits more in this process? Is it the is it us? Is it the broker? And how do they benefit? Is it the business owner? Is it the business buyer? Is it the customers? You know, mm. um, so you want to take number one, the us, the, the agency, the the partner. How do we benefit? OK, well, we benefit. Uh, well, we went over a few ways. We went over the fact that you don't have to get a lot of clients anymore. Uh, we, we, we went over the fact that after you get a couple partners, they can be your lifetime like income from now on. We've been right. over, went over the fact that you can control businesses without even having any legal uh, 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 responsibility. I mean, legal liabilities or responsibilities. Um, we went over the fact that you, I don't know if I mentioned prospecting again, but once you plug in a 10 monetization methods to whatever partners you're dealing with, you're definitely going to get to or surpass the 200K per month. Right. So the, these are just all all benefits for you guys watching this. If you're an agency owner, I know it's business buyers watching this, too. Uh, and you guys are going to get the same benefits of the agency owners. But since you're you came in as a business buyer, you might not appreciate what I'm saying as much as the agency owners, because the agency owners have a hard life. They make it look glamorous on Instagram and all of that bull crap. But unless you are Iman Gassi or one of these dudes, agency owners have a hard life, which is why you notice that the natural progression of an agency owner is to then create a book, then a course, uh, and, and then like try to sell their agency and leave it alone for good. That's the natural progression. Who wants to deal with all of those nine to five jobs, which are called clients. This is why it's agency to partner. Go ahead. Right. Next is broker. How does the broker benefit more? Let me piggyback or, or land back, if you would, on the, uh, the, the notion of the, the agency owner currently. When, you, when you're out in the field, now, when you're working with brokers who are familiar with, let's say in your city, you're working with three or four brokers. First of all, that's enough, one is enough because they have five, 10 listings. And if you just work with a portion of those listings, you're good. You don't need, uh, as we talk about. So if you have five businesses that you're working with from three brokers, you're, you're actually good. The, the 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 thing that you also have to remember is now you can leverage those brokers because they're familiar you can literally say to the to owners that you meet hey are you in the business of selling your uh, of, uh, you want to sell your business and you can refer that to a uh, someone who who is familiar with the process who then sells them not only on the, the whole notion of buying or selling their business, but they do the sales for you as it relates to the digital twin. So all you're Ooh. doing is referring them. You don't even have to talk to the business owner if they want to sell their business. So just wanted to put that out there. It, we, we're making this so simple. It's oh, like, let me add one more thing, man. Okay. And then we're going to move on to how the brokers benefit. Yeah. Listen, listen, y'all agency owners you get a retainer for 5k you go on youtube and start bragging about how you signed your first client for 5k how much of that really goes into your pockets if you're really trying to get them results i'm not talking about if you don't care about getting the results i'm talking about if you're really trying to get them results you might depending on the service you might be left with half of that maybe because the rest has to go to fulfillment Right. Or ad budget or something like that. What if <clears throat> when you partnered with the uh, the what used to be a client, their responsibility is to continue with that ad budget, continue with that 5K, 3K or whatever. But now it is full profit for you. You see what I'm saying? And on top of that, 
you're still getting the 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 commissions from getting them every piece of their sale. And we didn't even go into the 10 monetization steps of how every time they get a sale, you're going to make money from the transaction fees as well. How you're going to be putting uh, things that are going to make you money on their thank you pages, how you're going to take their email list in their SMS list and be able to promote different offers, CPA offers, affiliate offers, and make a whole new income stream for them and you from that. How you're gonna create another income stream, like three income streams from the interview that we teach you about. Like, dude, just... How, how anyway, you gotta, let's move, let's move on, man. Uh, When you clone the website, put a chat bot on there that will increase their, you know, a sales chat bot that will increase their uh, their sales because the, the bot every time gives information, but it also comes back and gives, uh, hey, you, you're ready to you're ready to move on. You're ready to, you know, buy those roses for your wife, for your girlfriend yeah. or whatever. Hashtag all, all of that. Hashtag. So, all right. So brokers, how does the brokers benefit? Well, in the broker life, there's there's one thing that matters and one thing only sales. And how do I and so how do I or actually selling the business for that person or for that, you know, it's not even necessarily prospects because a lot of them get a lot of referrals. So it, it's about sales and how do I get more sales? Well, that becomes about delivery and, and you know, basically uh, turnaround time. How long does it take to sell from the time I sign somebody up, from the time I sign that chiropractor up to the time that, you know, I actually, we sign on the dotted line and it goes through escrow and the business closes. How long does that take? On average, it's taking basically anywhere from six to nine months. The, the median being about eight, eight months, eight and a half months, quite honestly, because some of them are out there that takes three years. So it's not just the sale, it's how long it takes. What's the turnaround time? What's the cycle time of that process, yeah. right? Now, if you can reduce the turnaround time, then for them, that is the golden key because Damn. that means that they're in right? That's the golden key. Now, so how can I help reduce the turnaround time? I can put this sexy, <laughs> just, this completely sexy, turbocharged, superpower advantage, plug that right into the business. And when it becomes so much more attractive to a potential buyer that has not only several streams of income, but two different entities that they can buy. That becomes really, really attractive and nobody else is doing that. So I can sell that business much faster than uh, it's so much more attractive, which means I can sell it much faster than I normally would. And that's mm -hmm. the key to bro. Now, you got all the other benefits. They get double commission. They get the ability to get equity. They get the ability to um, sell one and keep the other. They, I mean, there, there's all sorts of benefits there. But the biggest benefit is for them to be able to reduce their cycle time such that they can make more money by selling even more Woo! and having a footprint in the business. Listen, that's there. That's that's golden, man. That is golden. We gotta go and create a dang on video for the brokers specifically on a whole different channel because how you just explained that. I'm like, damn. Okay, <laughs> that's crazy. If I was a broker listening to that, yeah. But anyway, okay. So all right. So that's the pinpoint for for brokers how they're gonna benefit. So next is how is the business owner that's selling the business going to benefit and i'll tackle this one it has okay. and then then curtis you can land back all right um like right off top for me is the fact that they're going to be able to sell for way more way Absolutely. more than they were initially planning on like guys uh, uh curtis was talking about how it, it might uh uh you know, take six to nine months for some businesses to sell. 
right? That might not be such a bad thing with how we're going to work with the business owner. Within six to nine Within months, six. we can possibly open up another location, right? Right. How we create the digital twins, once they're profitable, they can pay for the physical locations. They can cover the, the overhead. They can cover the, uh, you know, uh, uh, the, what do you call it? The, the opening of it. The, uh, I was about to call it the launch. I've been online too long, but you get what I'm saying. Like the, the, the online, opening. exactly the online version of the physical business, we build that out first. And then, so it's like the reverse of how we started. We start with the, with the physical business existing and we create the digital twin. When we want to uh, uh, multiply locations, we'll do it online digitally first, create sales by, create demand in different locations, uh, start generating sales with partners that can do the fulfillment there first to prove the market in those places. And then we use our profit share that we got from those, from working with those partners to open up the locations. So three to six, six months will be enough time for us to create multiple locations and they'll be able to sell for way more. So having that conversation with a business owner would be like you know like okay yeah let's do let's take the whole nine months to sell if we're gonna do something like that right um right. okay so that's them being able to sell for more so that's super exciting already but yeah. then this usually when it when when the sale is done uh it might be over for them that might be it i heard in some situations where they still uh get to maintain some type of uh um uh, month, yeah, equity or some type of monthly uh, payout or something to keep yeah. their lifestyle or something going like that. Well, now that increases. So now we'll be able to go to the business owner even after you sell, you're still going to be able to maintain around this much based off of how much we were making when you closed for if nothing That's changes, right. if none of, none, of, none of the variables change, right? So it's, it's a lot of ways that they're going to be able to benefit. A lot of the business owners Absolutely. probably won't even want to sell no more. They probably want to do, you know what? Now, this is what I got into this business for. Let's let's do this. They might want to stay on, right? Um, That's right. And they, they may want to keep their portion of the digital twin in order to have continue to have passive income. Okay. Yes, for sure. For sure. Now, yeah, that's yeah, that's what I was thinking of. But yeah, you got it right. So after this, we're gonna show you guys the ebook that we uh uh, uh that Curtis created for the, to educate the brokers, so that we don't have to educate the brokers, so that you don't have to educate the brokers, and and we have the ebook for the owners, so that they know like the broker is going to give the ebook to the business owner, and we're not gonna get on a call with them if they don't read that freaking ebook, right? Uh, right. So everybody is going to be educated of what the digital twin is. So that's the part that agency owners can feel relieved of that. Usually when you get on a call with somebody is to educate them. Then you're trying to set up a second appointment for the close. No, 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 no. Forget all that. We want like we don't even want to have the it shouldn't be a close. The broker should be bringing them on there for onboarding. Like they should already exactly. have agreed to our terms and conditions, yo, ma'am or sir, based off of your industry, in order for us to pull this off, you're gonna need to put 1500 down and at least 500 a month for the, for this industry, right? It varies with industry. And if they agree to that, then cool. If they don't, then guess what? It's other business owners that you'll be able to be referred to by the by the brokers, right? Um, 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 if you guys, you know, ever like believe in one of the businesses enough to where you want to like invest in it, nothing is stopping you, right? Like we're not stopping you from doing it. So if you be like, man, I love this, the, their mission, I love their product and all of that. Their reviews are awesome. Uh, even though they ain't got the money, I want, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and fund the marketing campaigns at least for the first two months. Okay. Well, do your thing. Cause then you'll be able to get even more out of the company. Right. So whatever you want to do. But our goal is to show you how to get buyers benefits 
uh, uh, an equity benefits from a business without actually using your money or anybody else's money in your money, your credit or anybody else's credit. We don't even have to have that as a discussion just by using okay. the skills and the gifts and the offers that me and Curtis are going to give you inside agency to partner membership. You'll be able to um, now, like, cause it's the new addition, the brokers. Uh, at first we were teaching you uh, to make the partnerships yourself. But now we're going to have the brokers in there that's going to make the partnerships for you and educate them for you, right? Or if you already have clients, guys, you're just going to send them this book that that Curtis created (laughs) and they're going to hit you back. I'm like, yeah, let's do that. Let's let's do that one right there. Let's do that model right there. I guarantee you, uh, Curtis created an awesome book for business owners and for uh, the brokers. So you, if, for those of you watching that got clients already right now, I don't care if it's one or three, send them this book. And I know that they're going to hit you right back. I'm like, let me be a partner. Let, let's do that one right there. Right? right. Okay. Let's move on. So, so the, the, the thing that the, I think is important about uh, what what you said was as it relates to you know the the business owner and them them selling and the, let's say the business owner doesn't have the money and you don't have the money well you can start with some of the other um, monetization methodologies and make mm. some money mm. really quick right I mean mm. SMS and email you can start with some of those make a few hundred dollars really quick and then move that money into a a campaign so Mm. you don't have to have the money up front all the time you can (laughs) let's make money with the with the the actual um you know cpa offers let's make some money with the the uh, thank you page let's make some money with a quick sms let's create an offer let's create a black friday offer boom right now create that black friday offer make some money take a portion of that money and for february or uh, december now you have a budget damn okay man see that's what it means to be resourceful, guys. Uh, you heard people saying making nothing, uh, something out of nothing. Yo, he just hit yeah. y'all up the head with with with, with the dang on hot frying pan. I hope you were paying attention. So, <laughs> I hope that got your attention, man. So even if the business owner, like I wasn't even thinking of that, right? Even if the business owner don't have the budget to like start running ads or doing the SEO campaigns, if they have, we in, on the inside the agency department, we teach you to, you know, through the agreement, you're going to have access legally to their email list mm-hmm. and their SMS list. This is all of the customers that's previously bought from them or opted in on their sites from the moment that they started business all the way up until now. So it's easy to sell somebody that already bought something from you. So what he's talking about doing is when we teach you to send out a reactivation campaign, okay? This is, hey, we haven't saw you in a while. Last time you were in here, we fixed your braces. You know what I'm saying? How about, you know, we know how difficult it is for you to keep your teeth clean up under those mugs. So how about you come in for... Fifteen, uh, fifteen dollars off a of teeth whitening. Right. Reply back to this text. So what he's saying is, when he, uh, when those people reply back to those texts and they come in and everybody pays, you know, twenty five dollars or whatever, blah blah blah, at the end of that week and you got almost a thousand bucks or something like that. That's enough money to run a new Facebook ad for the same freaking offer in that area. You see what right. I'm saying? So you can use what they already have to create the uh, the budget, the marketing budget for them. So that's, that's yeah, that was bars right there. That was bars, Curtis. That was bars, Right. All right. So business buyer, what does the business buyer get out of it? Well, all of a sudden, the business buyer goes from, well, let me, let me give you a scenario. I buy a business. I walk into the business. The moment I walk in, here's the two things that happen. The first thing is the employees start saying, well, you know, 
I haven't gotten a raise and blah, blah, blah. And this was wrong. And that's what's wrong. And this is wrong. And that's what's wrong. And you know what? I'm going to quit if I don't get this, this, and this. Happened to me every single time. Every time. <laughs> Second thing that happens is the, the business customers basically are like, you know what? I was loyal to X, Y, Z. I don't know you from the man in the moon and the cherry on the top. So <laughs> I don't have any loyalty to you. I don't have to stick with you. I don't have a prepaid with you or anything such that I have to stick with this business. So I'm going to go shop around. Okay. Mm. You walk into a, as a business owner, when you just bought a business with the digital twin, you walk into a situation where you can lose a certain amount, 20, 30% of your business because you can ramp up a portion of that business on the other side with that digital twin. So as a, a the benefit to a business buyer is that they reduce the amount of risk that they have of that business turning sour literally immediately. So that's the first thing. Second thing is they make a dif differentiation and they can ramp up their other side. See, we probably have not optimized in six to nine months all the things that you can do with that digital twin. We probably only scratched the surface, right? Mm -hmm. To get yep. another extra 50, 75, $100,000, $200,000 out of the total company with the sale. So we've only scratched the surface. The next owner can take it to the next level. That next owner can really... Um, you know, organize the affiliate militia, can really organize the affiliate marketing army, can really organize and take advantage of all the partnerships and the affiliate nation that that partnership brings. The next owner can do that. Whereas, you know, we, we, we did it to increase and skyrocket the value, that next owner can take it to the moon. And that's a big deal. So they benefit that way. They benefit from the way of being able to just, you know, take advantage of all the things that's coming up as it relates to um, AI and the digital side and utilize, truly utilize their physical as a physical distribution and outlet for the digital. Mm. And that's how I think that they, they truly benefit. The other thing is the potential of that business is double and triple. They probably are buying a business at a value that's quite, quite honestly, less than the true value and certainly a lot less than the potential value of that business. And so when I talk to brokers all the time about the physical business, they always talk about, yeah, it has the value of this and you can do this and you can do that. Just take a look at one of the listings. What would you do if you were staying on? Well, I would do this and I would do that and I would do this. That's bull crap, bull crap, bull crap, bull crap. <laughs> hey, they're not doing all that, you know, and there's no, whereas when you had a digital twin, you know that, you know, you know, agency owners, you know that you can basically do an SMS campaign. You know that you can do CPA offers. You know that you can do um, click-to-call offers. You know that you can do the, the thank you pages. You know that you can do email campaigns. You know that you can do clones, look-alike content or things on, on Facebook. You know you can do all of these things. You know that you can... They're not doing those things. And I guarantee you, go look at a listing on Biz by Sell. I guarantee you, they don't show the things that you can do on the digital side, what they're talking about you should do until, in order to increase the business. That's the difference. But so, difference. But so, oh, by the way, even, and you, well, let me just say this. You as the agency uh, partner, you can actually stay on with the new owner and get a fee there. Because they need yeah, to man. know how to. Oh that. snap! You you right, man. Because <laughs> because this is is literally inherited trust. See, guys, do y'all see how realistic it is? Because somebody was asking, "Oh, how can you guarantee that uh, we can get to two hundred k per month?" Listen, we're not telling you guys to sell trinkets on TikTok. 
This is big boy business. We're telling you to go into a, a niche where you're helping people buy and sell businesses. Becoming a partner of people that buy and sell businesses, just by default, you're going to be making more money than most niches out there. Everybody is trying to juggle and figure out which niche should I join with my agency. Dog, like these brokers are making a killing and the business owners make a killing and the person that's buying the business, they make a killing. Check this out. <clears throat> I didn't even think of that. So you're going to inherit like trust with the new business owner because they're going to know based on reputation and communication with the broker and the previous owner, you're the reason why the, the valuation went up. So right. they're going to have this little fear of like, okay, what if it goes back down? Right. So they're going to like, how, how much will it take? You know, like what would it take for me to keep you on as a consultant or advisor or, or, or something like that? Right. You are already right. still going to be making money from the part of, uh, portion of the digital twin that you own. Even when they sell off the physical part to the new business owner, your portion of the digital twin lives on. So if they uh, decide to keep you on as an advisor or give you some type of seat or something, that's a whole nother benefit in, in income stream. Right? Listen, Absolutely. and they're going to choose you over any other advisor because you're the one that took the business that they just bought and skyrocketed, man. Hey, Curtis, oh, you ain't with them. Let's not even forget the fact that the, the former owner just sold the business, just sold a portion of the digital twin. Do you think that that former owner um, just woke up the, the yesterday and don't know anybody? And you think that that former owner knows a few businesses, owners that like themselves? You think that the former owner wouldn't be bragging about the fact that they had a digital twin and and blah 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 and you think that the people that he he or she are bragging to won't be going well i want that yeah but so <laughs> that's all i'm saying like things like this guys oh. makes it to where you don't have to prospect anymore your reputation is going to just be spread it's just going to be you're just going to be that that guy or that girl, you know what I'm saying? You're just going to be that guy or that girl. So you're going to start getting hit up from anonymous places and stuff like, yo, 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 I heard that you sold blah, blah, blah. And they were selling it for 20K when you met them. And then they got out of it at blah, blah, blah. Yo, we need that same thing, man. What's going on? Like, what do we need to do? Imagine that, guys, versus you sitting and prospecting and begging or trying to craft an irresistible offer like I was telling y'all about and all of that. Now, people will be fed to you. Pause. Okay? Like cannibalism in marketing. Now, at this point. <laughs> but people will be fed to you. No longer. That, that, that's, that's why we don't enjoy our agencies. It's not really the fulfillment part. It's like the fact that we got to combine, combine the prospecting with the nagging and the fulfillment that we be like, you know what, forget all that. Now we can solve all that. You you guys need to go to, like, if you're smart, you would go to one of those first pin comment, uh, comment links. One of them, you understand, because we want to give right. you guys this wealth of knowledge and experience that we have. Like I said, I, I only sold one business. Only one. But Curtis has bought and sold multiple businesses. And I've increased the valuations of multi of countless businesses. So with our combined like wisdom, you guys are going to be fully equipped to make more money than you ever thought possible. Um, OK, so it's my turn. Number five, right? Yeah. And I, yeah. Number five, which is customers. We said that we would do. How does uh, how does the customer benefit from this? Okay, so the customer benefits because with us on the team, it's going to be way more creative offers that will benefit because when we create the digital twin, 
the company is going to have access to more customer data than it never had before with its just physical location. It's not going, it doesn't know how to like aggregate the customer data, analyze it and come up with new offers like that are like personalized uh, for each customer and everything. We, we leverage AI and all of that stuff that's going to create like offers that are tailored for their uh, previous and uh, previous current and new customers coming in. On top of that, as Curtis mentioned before, <laughs> we're going to add a new income stream to their current customers by converting their current customers into affiliates. And when they use the power of word of mouth, and we'll just use the example of the dentist, the dental practice again. All right. So remember, we were talking about we're going to have access to their email list and their SMS, and we're going to reach out and send a reactivation campaign. Well, this time, when we reach out through that email, SMS, and DM uh, list, what we're going to be saying is, hey, you've been coming to us for years, but we've never had a chance to pay you back. You've given us so much money with appointments, but we never had a chance to pay you anything. How about this? You have at least five to 15 people in your family. For everybody that you get to come in for a teeth whitening session, we're going to pay you that. Oh, snappage. Come on, y'all. Come on. So now these people that just went in to get their teeth cleaned can actually turn this to a business. Now, once they run through their family, pause, they're going to start thinking, dang, I got like, Hella friends go. on, I got hella friends on Facebook. Uh, Facebook. I, got friend, I got followers on TikTok in my location. And I got a little local YouTube channel because I'm a real estate agent and I, I talk about this. I can have a little clip in there. Hey, by the way, guys, you always been commenting that I smile a lot when I'm doing showings. And uh, this right. is the dentist that I go to. Tell them I sent you. Blah, blah, blah. Like, dog. <laughs> I think we killed it today, Curtis. You know, but y'all let Absolutely. us let us know in the in the comments with a hashtag yes Lord if if uh, uh you enjoyed this, if you've been edified, if you got clarity, if you understand that it would be dumb for you to buy businesses with your cash or even somebody else's cash. I'm sorry. I understand that that's leverage, but now with this new technology and with this new knowledge that you guys have you understand that there's another option you don't have to leverage credit or money now right. you don't have to have a face on there nothing nothing tracing back to you for real for real or nothing like that other than the simple agreement form like you and you can have all the benefits of being an owner right, right. and more and more if you're an agency so Curtis, uh, if you want to say something and then go ahead and show them a little little snippet yeah, of the you, book. If you let me, if you uh, share, give me permission to share the screen really quick. Uh, dang, I'm on this phone. I don't, I don't know. If uh, not, then, then I can always, we can always, if there's people that's interested, we can always send it to them. Well, guess what? Yeah. We'll send it to them and... Like I said, in the first pin comment, guys, it's a two-hour session. Like my yeah. sessions for SEO used to be a one to three K for me to sit on a call and go through SEO with you for an hour or two. So you get two coaches, and we're gonna outline and lay out everything we're discussing with you in detail, like literally saying, go do this, go do this. Go do right. this. This is how you partner with the broker. This is how, this is what happens after you partner with the broker to get them to just feed you the business owners that are ready to expand or exit. This right. is how you monetize the 10 steps, right? And You're so going to get all of that. And you'll get the two ebooks. You'll get the two ebooks, one for brokers that basically say digital game changer, how brokers can, uh, let me tell you the exact I'll tell you the exact uh, digital game changer, how brokers can use the digital twin to uh, to basically kill it, in essence. Uh, oh. I'll tell you the exact title. And then the other title, uh, this is not going to. 
false. The other title is uh, the profit generator, the nonstop profit generator, you know, which is for the owners. So you get book, you get the ebook for the, the business owners that you can send out to them and you get the uh, ebook for brokers that if you want to make contact with brokers you don't want to go through us and all that process and you will we'll help you do it yourself you know just do it yourself just here here you go here are two assets that you can utilize that you can leverage to uh, go out and do it yourself so for sure, for sure. okay that's where is it <clears throat> okay so if you, when you guys, I ain't gonna say if, right? We want 2024 to be the most profitable year that you've had so far. And when, not if, we want your success, we want to know when you're going to win, not if you're going to win. So when you go to one of those links in the first pinned comments, you're gonna be taking the step, the first step to controlling the win you're going to win this upcoming year, guys. Like, I, I can't baby food you. I can't Gerber you and bib you and belt you or burp you. All right? A, a lot of you guys watching this are grown-ups. You can't be scared to make money, and you can't be scared to pay or invest money. It's just paper. You exchange it for value of something greater. Okay, guys? So the first pin comment will be a coaching session if you want to Take it slow like John Legend and just get on there and try it like that. Or the first or the second um, uh, link will send you straight to where you can break up or pay the entire 5K. If it, whichever one is affordable for you is the membership. You're going to have access to us, access to the private community, access to the training in the membership, access to all the brokers that we're partnering with, access to anybody else that have any experience that we have, access to interviews that we're going to be doing and everything like that, guys. Like you're going to have full access to everything you need to go from where you are financially right. this year. If you're not great, if you're not happy are satisfied with where you are financially. This is as clear as I can make this. Looking over in the suggested section of YouTube for another tips and trick video is not going to change your life. We went through all of it. I've been on here since 2015, tried pretty much every business model, drop shipping, drop service, and drop all of that, right? Amazon, FBA, CPA, marketing, affiliate marketing, all of that. Everything works, but nothing allows you to be the controller of assets with no liabilities, right. no responsibilities, with the full benefits of being an owner without investing any money into the business itself while being able to gain a skill to grow any business that you want to at will. Come on, man. Come on, baby. Come on. So we got me and we have Curtis. You guys go ahead and take advantage of one of those two links in the pen comment. Did you want to say something to close out, Curtis? No, I, I think I think you hit it on. The, I, I think you you, you know, boom, hit it on the head as it relates to what they need to do. Take advantage of this, people. I mean, honestly, we, we, we couldn't have made it more simpler. I, I, all the methodologies that you use, we've solved all of or as many problems as we, as we could figure out, you know, what would be your issue? I don't have no people. OK, we'll go solve that problem for you. I don't have no I don't have no money to buy a business. OK, we'll go have to solve that problem for you. I don't have I can't do. We've solved all the problems for you. All you have to do is show up. I don't know how we can make it more easier. I, I really don't. Listen, I, honestly, listen. I, I the that. scripture, the scripture says, "Feed the flock." You know, tell them the truth, whether they hear or forbear. After the first and second ammunition, reject. So we can only tell you so much before we just talking to a wall. Uh, some of you right. are stubborn. You know that you need this, but you're going to, you know, let me check out a few more things before I make a decision. Well, let me tell you all this. Problems don't stay the same and prices don't stay the same. Problems get worse without action. It's never going to be a point in history where you stay still 
and the problem gets better. It's only going to get worse. If you are behind on rent and you don't do nothing, next month is going to be worse. If you owe on your car and they're threatening to repossess it and you don't do nothing, it doesn't get better. Quit sitting in Christianity and just magically hoping things and blessings are going to fall in your lap. The scripture says, by God, actions are weighed. You got to do something. You got to, there is no cash in without action. You got to do something, guys and gals, whoever's watching this. You have to do something. So on the other side of fear is is usually the freaking success that you just, it's this thin veil. It's like a little super microscopic thin veil separating you from being where you want to be financially. And money can't buy happiness. Uh, a rapper said money can't buy happiness, but it's a, a damn good uh, down payment. <laughs> Because, like, it solves enough problems to put you on a path to where you have enough time freedom, location freedom, and financial freedom to to then locate the happiness that you want. The Bible says, seek peace and pursue it. So if you, you know, some of you guys might think this is not a good business model. I doubt it, but if, if you're being honest, but if you... Know that this can bring you peace. You should not let no amount of money stop you. Are we charging high? Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Right? Like if this is going, this is a transformation. If you've been fat all your life and then you came to a coach that can like get you the six pack just by following them in six to nine months, that's worth whatever. That's worth what freaking ever for that transformation. We're trying to help you transform emotionally, mentally, and financially. You hear me? Just by doing this business model, it can help you. Okay? Curtis, go ahead and close it out. I was just going to say, you know, we talk about cost and price. Yeah, What's relative? It's it's all relative. Go on Biz by Sale, LoopNet, um, buy your biz, go on Craigslist and look at people who are selling businesses. You're buying a business. And here's what I promise you, because this is going to happen, regardless of whether you buy and whether you're in there or not. Here's what's going to happen. This is going to be packaged as a, a, a digital twin agency. And it's going to be by January, the end of January, it will be on Biz by Sell and NoopNet for fifty to $75,000. Mm. You can pay me now or at the Fram commercial. I'm dating myself right now. There is a, <laughs> a, a, a filter commercial. Pay me now or pay me later. Yeah. yeah. What we are giving you, what, what's going to be the difference between that $50,000, $75,000 business? It's a package of if you're in, um, if you're in Long Beach, California, it's a package of brokers that are in Long Beach that will specifically work with you and you have unlimited amount of businesses. Boom. You you Boom. have more than you could ever handle. Whereas right now we're teaching you. So we're doing everything that we're doing for you right now will be in a done for you type of scenario. All you have to do is just plug yourself in and you're not doing it on a gig basis. You're not doing it on a, a side gig basis, a yeah. side hustle. Hell, hell with that. If you pay fifty to seventy five thousand dollars, you're actually working your business on a daily basis because you're trying to make yes, millions of dollars, right? And yes, so sir. we're gonna sell that. You can take advantage of where we are now, or next year you can pay fifty to seventy five, a hundred thousand dollars. There's a broker company out here in Arizona, in Phoenix. They sell you a broker, uh, a, a business broker company for $100,000. This is no lie. You can go on Biz by Sale and put in business broker. To They sell you a $100,000 company and they give you nothing other than SOPs and yeah. a couple of leads in a month. That's it. You know, and that's a good idea. I'm happy you brought that up. What we should do, 
you know, to start, no offense to anybody watching right now, I hope you guys, I pray that you guys are action takers, but to hop in front of the real people uh, uh, that want to be action takers on something like this that wouldn't be even considering 5K as high, think about this. I targeted you guys through keywords for so, uh, Cody Sanchez, uh, targeted you guys uh, through keywords for buying businesses. You guys should be used to seeing numbers like 5,000, 10, 20, 30, 100,000. Those numbers shouldn't scare you, right? So instead of you spending that money that you were going to spend on um, the actual business understand. itself, all you're doing is replacing that with a, a lower cost version of getting into our membership where then you'll still be able to get the business, but you won't have to pay the 50 or the 20 or the 100 grand that you were going to pay. So it's actually way more beneficial for you guys. But what we're going to start doing is we're going to start targeting keywords for people that are interested in buying franchises. Exactly. Because then they'll know for a fact that, you know, okay, we'll we'll know for a fact that these people are serious. And I, like I said before, there's no disses. I, I pray that you guys are serious. We'll find out, right? Um, but yeah, we're going to start doing those type of videos too. It's a, it's a channel called Franchise City that I used to watch. And it used to be like, yo, don't buy a subway. <laughs> right? So uh, guys, yeah. gals watching this, it's time to grow up, y'all. If you are past the age of 30, do this. Do it. You hear me? Like, you, no yeah. more room for error. You hear me? Like, it's time to start building a legacy. It's time for money because God didn't make it. The, the, the streets of heaven are paved with gold. God didn't make it to where money is supposed to be like our main concern in life and that's all we think about 24 7 the only reason why we think about it so much is because we're afraid of lack of it but the moment you get some stability and you start growing it and it takes on a life of its own through these 10 monetization steps now you can focus on the things that really make you happy that's why i said it's a good down payment Right now you can start going on trips. Now you can spend more time with the wife that was about to cheat on you or leave you and you had no idea. You only got one month left before you find out she's about to head over your brother's house. Now I'm getting a little extreme. I'm just messing with y'all. Or maybe, no, I'm just playing. <laughs> okay, but my point is guys, I said it before, problems don't get better with time and price don't get lower unless you get some type of special, but that's temporary, right? Prices go up when value increases, and we're going to continue making this more valuable with more partnerships, more joint ventures, more experience, more knowledge, case studies and stuff that we're working, working on and stuff currently. All of that stuff is going to make it to where this is just some type of once a year mastermind where heads of industries can get access to it. Soon, you it won't be just common knowledge guys so we're trying to make it accessible for everybody and i said everybody because even though it's 5k when you go to the site this is the second link right it's the second link in the pinned comment even when you go to the site it has an option multiple options for you to break up the payments this is no excuses right none this is the best thing that I've seen in affiliate marketing, a business buying agency model, drop shipping, drop servicing, CPA, whatever you want to call it, coding. Uh, a lot of you guys are coding and starting going to these coding boot camps so you can go and get a tech job and all. None of that is messing with this. That's not a cocky thing. It's, it's, a, it's a guy thing because you're supposed to have assets and we want to control assets. That's right. Okay. But anyway, we're going to ride off into the sunset because uh, uh, I, I'm on the phone, so I can't give Curtis access to share the screen, which sucks. Uh, but like he said, if you book uh, when you, we're not going to use the if word, when you guys book a call, uh, uh, not a call, when you guys book a coaching session in the first pin comment, take the leap. Don't count your ducats. Just go to the link now and just do it, right? Or when you go to the second one and you get inside the membership, you're going to have access to all of our assets and all of our contacts. Curtis has been buying freaking businesses and selling them since you were in diapers, getting diaper rash, hoping that your mama sued Johnson and Johnson. Okay. <laughs> 
So I'm just, I'm just, just trying to let them know the gravity of it, man. For real, for real. So, all right, man. Uh, there's only so much that we can say. Jay Z voice. Um, let's go. Um, do a Jet Li sidekick, G Kundo style to the share button. Put this in all of the entrepreneur business buying uh, affiliate uh, uh, franchise and, and and freaking oh agency marketing agency groups and stuff like that. Share this with any agency owner that you know, and tell them we challenge them to have a better agency model than what we're showing you guys right here. All right, love you guys. See you in the next one, Laura's will. All right. Take care.